Hello everyone, Ronnie J here from InternetRadioStation.com and RipRadio.com. I'm the DJ over at Rip Radio Smooth Jazz WRIP. In this video, I'm going to share with you my particular crossfade and gap killer settings on Rip Radio Smooth Jazz. I played around with these settings and they work very well for me. My version of Sam Broadcaster is version 4.9.8 and these settings should work well for any version of Sam Broadcaster. So the first step is going to config and go over to where it says crossfading. The first thing I want you to notice here is this graph. Your graph should look like this after all the settings have been inputted. So starting from the top and working down where it says enable fade out. We want to check that make sure that the curve is set to S curve over to the right where it says enable fade in, uncheck that. Make sure that the S curve is set to S curve. Over where it says enable fade out, make sure your time is set to three seconds. Time on the right hand side here under fade in is set to zero seconds. Set your level here to 100%. Level on the right hand side to 100%. Your crossfade auto detect, make sure that's set to auto detect. Your fixed crossfade point, set that to 0.5 seconds. Set your trigger to negative 22 dB. Your minimum fade time, set that to 300. Your maximum fade time, set that to 6,000 milliseconds. And once you've done that, your graph should look like this right here. Then click OK. Next we'll go to the gap killer settings and these are equally important as your crossfade settings. Make sure all the boxes over here to your left hand side are all checked. Make sure that you trigger at negative 45 decibels. This is the remove silence from beginning of track. Make sure that the detect and skip blips box is checked. Make sure remove silence from end of track is set to a minus 40 decibels. This setting here is set to 20 milliseconds or less. Your trigger, set that to 15 seconds. Then click OK. Once you're done, go to File and Save Configuration. Very important that you do that File Save Configuration because if you don't and you exit out of Sam Broadcaster, you lose those settings. So those settings work very well for Rip Radio Smooth Jazz at ripradio.com. If you visit the internetradiostation.com website, and the URL is appearing on the screen right now, you'll find that I have a complete course on Sam Broadcaster. These are video presentations that take you through everything about Sam Broadcaster. So visit internetradiostation.com and also visit ripradio.com listen to some smooth jazz. This is Ronnie J from internetradiostation.com and ripradio.com. Thank you for listening.